thing I want to talk about is my boy, Blackie, Blackie, Somnyama, the hardest, the greatest, Yana Yedo. So another interview of his has come out from the States. The boy is just, is knocking on him, interviews, strike. <laughs> so he's, this time he's done it with uh, DJ Small Eyes, uh, which is really dope. It's a really dope um, channel. Um, I remember discovered, I remember discovering a lot of artists on DJ Small Eyes, like our uh, King Vaughn, all these people, you know, so it's interesting to see him on the show, which is dope. Shout out. And he actually speaks about not dissing anybody on the GMG freestyle because, um, you know, supposedly he dissed um, Usima Mani on the GMG freestyle. Um, but I guess now he's clarifying it to say, <laughs> nah, I ain't diss no boy. But hmm, I don't know. He's talking the truth. Yeah. Craziest rumor you heard about yourself. Craziest rumor. Hmm. Do I have any crazy rumors? I don't know. Not really. I don't think there's... Let me think. I have to think about it. Hmm. I didn't. I didn't put it on double speed because it's like it's like less than four minutes. So I thought we'll just watch it normally. Nah. Oh, craziest rumor by myself is this. There's a situation where um people thought like I made a diss song for someone. Oh yeah, I don't do disses. I don't. I don't move like that. So yeah. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> this must have been old because definitely you diss. You definitely diss Lucas. You know. And come on, let's keep it a bean. You dissed Uzi my man. Never, never made it this song in my life. Ah, look at that smirk. And, <laughs> look at that smirk. And <laughs> what's your po- why that policy free? Because there are some that do create diss songs about others. Uh, that might even be their thing. But what they're known for. Uh, why for you that policy where you don't? I mean, especially like where, where I'm from in South Africa, like it's a very small hip hop community. Like it's, I don't think it makes sense to go against each other. Exactly. It's like what I was talking about in the other video I made where I was speaking about um, Black and Lucas Raps beef. It doesn't make sense, man. It's, it's entertaining for the internet and it's fun, but for the culture and the movement and the industry, it's just detrimental. When, like, you know, we haven't even left, we haven't seen, like, the outside of South Africa. So, you know, going against each other there, I don't know. It's a bit weird. But, yeah, I don't, I don't, think, it, I don't think it makes sense. And care to share the title of the song that may have been misconstrued as a diss song, but it is not? Uh, GMG Freestyle. GMG Freestyle. Now, have you addressed not one of my favorite Blackie songs, but still a slapper, still a banger. My favorite Blackie song this year thus far has to be All Facts. Yo, I listen to All Facts maybe three or four times a day. Honestly, All Facts is chef's kiss. Is this publicly or is this your first time? Well, on camera, nah, not, not exactly, no. Nah. So you have mentioned this before that it's not a diss song. You've- yeah, I've, I, I think I, I put out like something on Twitter just saying like that. Nah. Yeah. And for those in the audience getting to know you for the very first time, care to share your screen name on X as they call it these days? Oh, yeah, X. It's, I think it's the same thing. Some yama and I the same as Instagram. Mm. And um, what is your policy? No, but Instagram, Instagram is just it's blacky though. Oh, a screen name. Okay, not not username. Okay. I See, bet. when it comes to rumors, in this case, you mentioned you've addressed it on your Twitter or X, as they call it these days. But generally speaking, is that how you operate? If there is a rumor about you, you uh, address it, or there are some that sweep them under the rug and let people talk. How do you normally operate there? I don't, yeah, I let, I let people talk, I don't really, that was like the first and last time, because I actually regretted after, like, why would I do that, because then it seems like I care, and it seems like there's something in it, so, yeah, I, I'm never doing that again, just let people say whatever. And why that policy for you? Because, 
you know, nine times out of ten, I don't really, you know, it doesn't really matter like that. Like, it doesn't affect me in any way, you know, if I did or did not. It doesn't affect like the the largest. <laughs> but he did though. But he did though. But it makes sense. But uh, I understand what he's saying because uh, sometimes addressing things it's not worth it. Like, sometimes you just gotta let the internet think what the internet wants to think. Scale of things. There's a bigger picture. There's a bigger vision. So delving into those smaller things is just nah, not smart. For sure. For sure. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Uh, but yeah, anyway, shout out to Somyama, the hottest, the greatest. Shout out to DJ Small Eyes. That's that's pretty much dope. As you as you heard, guys, he didn't diss anybody. Wink, wink. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move on.